we have had seven new FDA approved treatments for multiple myeloma. So this, this year's version of the meeting on hematologic malignancies will incorporate all of these advances uh, which weren't even available but a year ago. The need therefore has never been greater to try to make these advances count for patients, to, to really increase the awareness and educate caregivers and patients alike as to the appropriate use of these new medicines. In the meeting of hematologic malignancies sponsored by ASH, uh, what we do is we have sessions that are called How I Treat the Various Cancers. And in fact, they are case-based, real live case-based teaching uh, which, uh, in which an expert in the given area discusses how he or she would approach the management of these various diseases in the context of all the new medicines. The other reasons to attend the uh, meeting on hematologic malignancy sponsored by ASH is the wonderful opportunity for interaction, not only with other attendees, but there's been time built in over the breaks and the meal times, etc., so that one can really have one-to-one -one interaction with experts and really try to come away with uh, some first-hand knowledge based on sort of bench-to-bedside translation of how it is you should be taking care of patients with these hematologic malignancies in 2016.